All right, what's up everybody? Everybody having fun? I'm having fun too. Wow, this is crazy. First time I've done this in a little while. Some stuff was going on. Anything going on with you guys? Some stuff was going on for a minute. Get the hands warmed up here. So, this next band is from Canada. I'm originally from Canada, so these guys were like heroes of mine growing up. And uh, between 74 and 1975, they put out three studio albums and like toured those albums incessantly. And by the end of 75, they'd had some modest success, but sales were starting to wane a little bit. And the label said, guys, like they were almost going to drop them, but they said, guys, we'll give you one more shot. Give you one more shot, one more record. So on one condition, you got to write some hits. We need some hits. So what did they do? An album called 2112. <laughs> There's no hits on 2112 per se, but it did go on to sell over 3 million copies in the U.S. I mean, the first song on 2112 was 20 minutes long. So, what's my point? The point is, this is a band that decided to live and die kind of on their own terms, and that is about as punk rock as it gets to me. They did exactly what they wanted to do and didn't compromise. And actually, the song that we're about to play from 1980's Permanent Waves album really embodies that spirit in both the music and the lyrics. Let's try it. <laughs> 